Hi, in this video we're going to show you a way to unhide your taskbar using your keyboard instead of your mouse if you have the automatically hide the taskbar option configured in Windows. So normally when you use this you hover over with your mouse and then it will unhide the taskbar. But if you're working on something, let's say you want to see all the way down to the bottom of the screen and it keeps on bringing the taskbar back up, uh, you could use this tool here to change that to where you have to press a key in order to restore the taskbar. Alright, so what we're going to use is the Windhawk app. So we've used this for many videos, so there are a lot of uh, cool features and cool things you could do with it. So how it works is you install the Windhawk app, which is free. Then you add mods, which will customize or tweak the way Windows works. So you have your home screen, which shows your installed mods and some featured mods. And then you could explore. And you know you could sort by newest and popular and that type of thing, or do a search. And then once you find the one you want, just click on Details and then Install. All right, so we already have the one installed here. So it's called Taskbar Keyboard Only Auto Hide. But right now it's disabled, so I could enable it from here or go into Details and enable it here. Then we have some settings here. So this Fully Hide setting I don't really get because it says Taskbar is normally hidden to a thin line, which could be clicked to unhide it. But I don't see a thin line down here, so you can see how it works for you. All right, so now that it's enabled, you can see we put the mouse down there and it doesn't come back. But if I press either the Windows key or Control Escape, it'll bring it back. It does pop up the uh, Windows Start menu, unfortunately, no matter which one you press. So if I do Control Escape, it does the same thing, but it brings the taskbar back. And then you can do what you need to do from here. Like that. And then you could, you know, open your files or whatever you want to do. And then if you don't want to use it, just simply click on Disable. Or you could actually remove it from Windhawk if you no longer want it. And then when you hover the mouse back over, it'll bring it back up. Alright, so we did some other videos on some other ways to hide the taskbar. Uh, we have another one with Windhawk where you could actually change the speed and timing of when it hides and unhides. And then we did some videos for some other ones as well, such as one that will hide and unhide with a certain keyboard combination or shortcut key. So you might want to check those out. All right, so I will put a link in the description where you can download Windhawk. And then just do a search for Taskbar Keyboard Only Auto Hide from the Explorer section here. Install it and enable it, and you're good to go. And then one thing with Windhawk is that it needs to be running down there in the system tray. So if you find that your mods aren't working, just come here and check, and it might have closed itself. And it should be set to automatically start with Windows when you install it. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.